this is an introduction to dopping gemstones for making cabochons. We're going to cover some of the methods and the materials used and in future videos we'll go into greater detail on uh, some of those methods. Um, dopping a gemstone is, is attaching a uh, preformed gem or uh, other type of stone to a stick and the reason you do this um, is to give you greater control when you're um, holding the stone uh, and uh, using a, uh, a machine to make a cabochon. Uh, it gives you better finish uh, of the stone, uh, a lot smoother. Uh, it's also faster than just holding the stone in your fingers and it also saves your fingers from being ground down and that can be quite painful. Uh, the thing that you attach the stone to is uh, called a dop stick. The dop stick can be anything from uh, a toothpick or a matchstick for a really tiny stone through to um, a steel nail or most commonly um, a piece of wooden dowel, usually about um, six mil or quarter inch in diameter, about four inches long. Um, the adhesives that are mainly used are either um, a sealing wax uh, or dopping wax and, and uh, the other main one is uh, just one of several types of adhesives. The most commonly used dop sticks are wooden dowels. You can buy these at a hardware shop uh, in long lengths and, and then cut them down into about 100 mil lengths uh, or about four inches. They come in various diameters and I select the diameter based on the, the size of the stone I'm doing. So the bigger the stone, the larger the diameter dop sticks. Some people prefer to use one diameter and if they're doing a smaller stone they will um, uh, shave a bit of timber off from around the edge. It doesn't really matter which way you want to do it. Um, wax uh, for attaching the dop sticks comes in different colours as you can see uh, the different colours have different melting temperatures generally if it's a, a heat sensitive stone that you're dopping you'll use a lower melting temperature wax now the green wax melts at 65 degrees celsius the red wax melts at 71 degrees celsius and the black wax at 80 degrees, this would be similar. Uh, the red wax is suitable for general purpose, but the black and this brown wax are more commonly used when you're um, dopping stones for faceting. We're not really going to cover that right now. Uh, to melt the, the wax, you would normally use uh, an alcohol lamp, such as the one under here. This is set up with a tripod and on top of the tripod you'd just have a small tin. You'd break some wax into that and then melt it down. If you don't want to use heat and you don't want to um, you worry about burning yourself, you can just use uh, super glues to hold the stones on. Uh, there's various types of super glues but just about any of them will do the job. At the end of the day you end up with something like. In the next video we're going to demonstrate some of these methods.